Welcome to I Don't Want to Do This. Welcome to Boss Fight Buddies. It's still BB, I'll accept it. Alright, where are you at? We're, uh, our Master of Ceremonies here gets to go against, um, the long haired. What's her name? Something? Something long hair? Ugh, that's not a good sight. No, it's not. I gotta do that a couple more times. I think. Oh wow! Five or six more times. Why she has she has nurse white shoes? Where did she spawn at? Spawn. What Thank if she's you. the nurse? Possible. I mean, she's wearing the same shoes. I, I'm I'm not gonna say yes or no. Okay, maybe she's just a nurse. Oh, that looks weird. All oh, right. There we go. Maybe she just belongs to the hospital somewhere as a nurse. Uh, I mean, do you really belong to your place of employment? Or do you, does the place of employment belong to you? In Japan? I think you belong to your place of employment. Okay, that is a, that is a true statement. See, what sucks is you have this boss fight. And they don't give you matches in the boss fight. Just a lot of flammable things. There's a lot of flammable things. What was that? That was number four? Um, Where are you at? This looks like an interesting room. Yeah, it is. Ow. Insta death. Move it to joystick! It's insta death. If she, if she grabs you, it's insta-death. Ugh. Boss fights like that are not right. No, no, yeah, I know. At least it's not like permadeath mode. Yeah, that would suck for this game. But as you saw, okay, yeah. You, uh, you gotta set her on fire. A few times. I think, I think seven times. Because that's base matches... Plus two torches. The, the inferno room looked interesting. Like yeah, but it sucks to use. Why? That's one. Cause she can get you there. Or we're trying to set that off as a trap. We're trying to set it off as a trap. It's kind of annoying. Two. Yep. Where you at? Come on. Here, doggy. Here, boy. So how would he set this off as a trap? Oh, there's a ladder there. Yeah. I see. And yeah, right now she's looking for and me. Fire! Ah, oh, fuck. I was using my match too. You want to give it a shot? Or you want me to do it? I don't know where everything is. Okay. I mean, so no, they give you I, I, ammo. I so were you supposed to be able to stall her or just shoot the barrels? Shoot the barrels. Shoot the barrels. Yeah, I, I hate don't. That it, it it spawns you after like you, you couldn't just have your save point be right here. Uh, it, yeah, yeah, that's kind of weird. Oh. So, I definitely disagree with like any sort of instant death. Uh, me too. Sort of. I disagree battles. with it. I disagree with boss fights that do half your life. I mean, it should be understand. Like, it should be okay if you're like in your last scraps of life at the end of a boss battle, but. Uh, and they give you a bunch of health and like resources at the end of it, but something like this, no, this is, yeah, this, this is pretty this, ridiculous. This uh, just like no room for error. Um, oh, well, very little room for error. I would say no room for error. I would I would say the first part was correct. Um, what the fuck? Eh. 
and then just like instant death. Yeah, and you just have to reset the entire progress of exactly. the boss fight. It's it's terrible. This this is a game where if you sit down, it's basically him going, "I have a great idea for a game," and then winging it because later the game will be like, "Oh, you're in you're in a building." And then you go through a door. All of a sudden, you're outside next to a barnyard. And then you go through that door, and you're in a different building than you were before. Like, it really is one of those, I had a, I had an idea for a game, let's make the game around the idea, rather than the idea around the game. Well, I mean, it's possible he's trying to, like, go through the whole psyche, you know, bit. Right? This is yeah. the human psyche and kind of going insane. And so, what's insane other than, you know, like things like this? Right? But. I mean, I understand that. Don't get me wrong. But. Again, we look ah, at it. So, she's spawning from here. Yeah. Come on, spawn. There we go. Oh, I got her. Alright, so three more burns. I think. Alright, so you got a smell here this time. Oh yeah, and by the way, she can grab you off of the ladder. Spam the melee! Like, that's one of the parts that I don't like. Is that, oh, you're climbing the ladder? She'll, she'll grab you off of it. Fun. Yep. Alright, you need one more. I think. I don't have any matches. Want to use a barrel? Oh, there's a, a torch up here. Torch up there. When you have memory like I do, it's handy. There she is. What? You k My what? kick came out. Why must it kick? God fucking damn it. So close. Yep. Yeah, this this is not a fun boss fight. I I will You know, up to this point it hasn't been that it's not that bad of a game, but here is where it's just well, I'm quite curious. Like, how many other games have the company ever made before this? This is the gum. This is the company's first game. Shinji Mikami's, like, way up there game. Yeah, well. And this is one of the few games he's made where I've seen just glaring design flaws all well, around. Well, I mean, maybe they were under a time crunch. If they were working with like new technology, new company, first time, uh, jitters, then. You well, expect, like, most rough. most of the people were his old team from Capcom. So it's it. Oh, thank God! So it's not like it was a new team; it was Capcom veterans. Hmm. It was Resident Evil team. Like I said, any there's there's not an excuse for a lot of this game. Yeah. Hopefully two more. Yep. If we can just find her next spawn point. There it is. Right on that body. But she should spawn on this body. Swear to God, if this isn't, then be so pissed. Oh, I'm pissed. 
plus a barrel. Uh, yeah, that is where I'm going. There should be one, right? She... There she is. Come here, Ringu bitch. Ah, she's still alive. Oh, I'm out of. To I'm out of. Well, oh, climb. You know, maybe it's like that last boss. Where you, you you had to bring your bring the boss to a trap in order to like efficiently handle it. Burn! Ah. Climb down. Ah! And you can only use those once. I don't know why you would design this fight to use more than the minimum amount of matches. And no, uh, I've seen, I saw Justin use the traps. Uh, Is that one hit kill? It's not a one hit kill. Ugh. He used, he on the, when we did it, he used both traps. And she kept going. And she kept going. Wow, that is Bullshit. insane. Is what it is. Yeah, I agree. Well, time to harvest what you have. I almost left without this. Old flame, huh? That was oh. the achievement. Oh. That popped up when you killed her. Oh. I wonder what that means. Probably someone you knew. I don't know. Look at me, I'm not Let's the expert see. of this game. We have... Well, what was the recent news stories? It was a parishioner, right? Yeah. That went away. You had your old wedding invitation. Or maybe this is suggesting old flame because, you know, she kept showing herself beforehand. Box. Um, this is one of the rooms where when you're done with it, you can't go back into it. So that's yeah. why I'm scavenging. How long did that take? I don't know. Too long. 13 minutes. Hey, screw you. I want to see you do it. No. There was another flammable one. Okay. Yeah, because when Justin did it, he killed it on He killed it on the flammable. Ridiculous. All right. And to think, this is your homework to play this game. Hey, just nothing quite like a ex expedited, you know, <laughs> boss run through. So, ah, uh, shit. So, you're gonna recommend not do this crap for whatever your company makes for it, right? Oh, hell yes. Okay. No, no. Bosses should be totally playable. In my opinion, a boss should be uh, killable without any upgrades correct if if I mean, it, could, it could be a challenge you can have the, an expected amount of upgrades yeah. but something for like the number of matches you have no that's that's a bit much exactly i don't think it was possible for you to kill her if you had no matches which it wasn't so is this the person that like became the demon uh, I don't know. I was oh. paying attention. That looks like brainstem. That looks like a brain. The telephone poles. So you gotta disconnect the umbilical cord. Ah. By smashing them? I mean, I was just seeing if you could pull it out right away, because I remember that's what you're supposed to do. 
Eat our numerous pistol rounds. Ah. Oh, nice. okay. You pull it out when they're on the ground. Ooh, that sounds something electric. Gonna oh, I thought you. he grabbed me. I was, I was like about to swear so loud you had no idea. Oh yeah. Man. Whoops, it's like, shit. It's like you're disconnecting them from the matrix. Unplug them! <laughs> That's important. My yep. priorities change so fast. Screw your. Okay, I can't get on you anymore. Unjack him from the Matrix! As I say, if I remembered correctly. You won't be able to pick up loot afterwards. Exactly. Safe bet. Oh, we just all safe head. That's the next boss. I don't want to do safe head. That's not the last we see of her either. Ah, why? There's another boss fight with her. <laughs> Ugh, and let me see. Oh shit! And we'll see you next time on Backlog Buddies. Bye.